All right, today we shall be unboxing the Roomba iRobot i3. And we'll do a quick little review. So here we go. Oh my God. <laughs> okay, so here's, here, here it is. Um, let me see if I can, here's the bad boy. I'll get the rest of this stuff out in a minute. It's quite appealing, I have to say. It's got little bumper guards. Here's the bottom, little sweepers. Interesting, well, uh, I'm gonna put this to the side here. All right, let's see what else we have in this box. We got the, um, getting started. Oops. Oh, here's the dock. A little dock. And then the charger right here. So let's, oh, one last thing. Extra, extra filter, good to have. All right, so I got it all set up. His name's Reginald, uh, it's ready to go. Let's do it for, excuse the crookedness. So setting this up was honestly like a little difficult. So I wanted to put it right here, but the cord is not long enough. So kind of had to put them over here. I think eventually I'm gonna move them to over here. But um, so you have to have, says it on here. Yeah, um, here we go. How much clearance you're supposed to have. So yeah, that was not too fun and easy. So this is like the only place with an outlet that I can really do it because I have stuff over here. There's not really space over here for it. Unless he ends up going in the closet, which could happen. Who knows? But so hopefully this is okay. I tried to give him room to get out. I might have to move this. In fact, I actually think I will. But um, yeah, you know what? I'm gonna move this real quick, hold on. All right, so uh, I moved stuff. So I think I'm gonna let him charge a little bit longer. And then I'm gonna let him go. See what he can do. I, I prepped everything, got everything off the floor. It does tell you to do that. I moved the coffee table because I want it. I really like this is the biggest thing for me. If it can clean this very well, I'll be I'll be shocked. So but I mean the little stuff like right here, like I know that's that's not gonna be an issue. And just everything here, like this is no problem, but we'll see. That's it's the big boy test right there. So I'll see you guys in a few. All right, he's gone. Oh my God, he's gone. He's kind of loud. He's gonna go explore. Oh, be careful. Oh. oh. He decided he does not want to go that way. Oh, professional. <laughs> so can he not get over that? Oh, there he goes. Oh, he's going, dude. Oh, I'm surprised he's going this way first, but whatever. Let him do what he's gonna do. Dude, how did he get there? Reginald! Reginald! The only thing that matters today is if you're not the best board, then you're not the best Oh no. You gonna get out? I think he's stuck. So, he got in through this side. He couldn't get in through this side. So, let's see if he can figure Come on. No, don't turn back. Don't turn back, Reggie. He's out. Oh, thank God. So, little update. You can see he went this one part, and that's it. I really wanted him to do this, but this is um. 
all he's got so far. But he's done pretty much everything else. So, I, oh, I'll get back to you. All right, so I sent him, so last night he ran out of battery. So I sent him back this morning. This is what the aftermath is. I don't know what that is. That's not from the Roomba, but carpet looks good. It looks a lot better than what it did before. I mean, it looks spotless. This is just scratches. I mean, this carpet over here looked great. I Again, I didn't put him in the room, so this is the only room he really got, as you can clearly tell. So far, I'm impressed. I'm impressed. Uh, I guess I can do a part two if anything changes, but I'm quite impressed. I mean, he did leave some scratches on the floor, which I'm a little, I think you can see that. It's a little weird. Not sure if maybe the his wheels are just dirty, but all right. Well, that was this video. Uh, see you guys later. So this is uh, what the bin looks like after, like, damn, it really got in there. This is after three, well, two real cycles. Let me see if I can, here, let me empty it for you guys. So this is basically all that came out, a big clump this big clump and i consider my like carpets and stuff like not that badly vacuumed so jeez good job so this is the aftermath of two cycles i mean this is kind of i'm kind of shocked with how much damage he's taken i mean two cycles and i mean it's looking pretty sh rough now granted i guess he's still exploring the place but damn but honestly, he's done a good job. He obviously cleared up a whole bunch of shit. So this is a this is a it's a good one. Thumbs up for me for sure. All right, so here's a little overview of the app, and it gets to you name him Reginald. That's what I named him. And you see all the history of when he cleaned up. This is a few days later, so I've sent him a few times. And it's pretty cool that he maps out like your whole landscape. Um, I don't. I like I showed you guys I have this one room blocked off so this is the first day and it canceled because you ran out of charge but and it's cool to show you like where there's extra dirt like here I thought that was sick it tells you all the stats one dirt event what it means so insanely cool and then you can also change the smart map but I just haven't done this yet Shows you like, oh, here you go. This is what I got so far. Yeah, definitely a vibe. I think uh, so sick. So all in all, I mean, it's pretty cool. I don't know if I would spend $300 on it. I got it for free, so kind of a little biased. But I mean, for I have a one-bedroom apartment. If you have a big house, I don't know how good that's going to be because the battery is not very good on that thing. But I mean... And also having to clean out the tank is kind of shitty. I'd rather just have it do it itself. I know you can get that. So, I, I mean, I recommend it. It's not bad. It vacuums very well. As you can see, it gets everything out. I haven't had any issues with places it missed or anything. And it's kind of cheap. So, it's not a bad. I'll, I'll give it 8 out of 10. Solid performance. Thanks for watching.